League. In fact, our last match in the top eight is going to be, sir. Hmm. A little bit of a cupcake. Yeah, my one of my favorite dessert time treats. Actually, I don't like cupcakes. I like I'm a brownie guy. I gotta be honest. Okay, I can versus yeah. <laughs> Senior Adam. So, I believe it's Abram. Senior, Abram, excuse Senior me. Abram. You were close. Abram. You were close. Um, so unfortunately, Mr. Shujinki Dink. I said his whole name just for him. You did, yeah. and he's not even here. Yeah, he was DQ'd. He was uh, super late today. We tried to wait for him. Unfortunately, we can't hold the whole tournament up. So my heart goes out to you, sir. You know. Yeah, he I'm pretty a, sad about it too. But he's a kid defeated. It is what it is. We all got jobs. Hey, he still made top 16. Still got those points. Still got the points, and he's been consistent throughout the entire season so far. He's looking great. Actually, so he's I think still he's, looking good. he's in the top four, I believe, as far as point earners. So point earners. He's there. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's definitely, definitely there. there. Now, yeah. we've seen Cupcake play before. Right. Did Who did he play? I believe it was Mr. Zero. Uh, yeah, I was thinking the same thing. Yeah, definitely a solid, very solid Sub-Zero. I have not seen Senior Abram, though. I, I haven't either, actually. I'm not too familiar with his name. So, like you always say, one of the best things about these tournaments. Wait a second. Did I hear Takeda? Oh, Ooh. yes. Finally. Oh, Cupcake is playing Johnny Cage. Takeda in the top eight? Interesting. What? T hey, man, Takeda is... Right. I, I feel Takeda is a very good character. All right, Dink, I'm glad you lost. Never mind. <laughs> I'm just wow. Kidding. I'm just kidding, did, buddy. Did you hear that, Dink? Did you hear how fast Dink. he You're turns it around? Our, our, uh, our brotherhood took it this week. I'm proud of you. So, Mr. Takeda here. So, he goes for the back two there. It, it does come out really slow. You really need to space it well. So, that's going to be a launcher. Oh, here we go. Nice combo. So finish it with an uppercut. That's... um. It's kind of the safe way to end it, I suppose. Also possibly pushing him towards the corner. Now we're seeing another stunt double, Johnny Cage. Yes. Oh, oh beautiful. Takeda has an amazing neutral jump punch. Oh, good spacing there. He whiffs that. Uh, I believe that's back forward two. Yeah, Takeda again with that neutral jump punch. Definitely one of the best. Not as good as Fair Tours, though. Oh, Fair Tours is out of control. <laughs> yeah, Fair Tours. That shouldn't even be called a neutral jump punch. It's Maybe I should teach it's you. The neutral flattening. <laughs> <laughs> but really solid stuff from Senior Abram. I like this. I actually, I play Shirai Ryu as well. I, Ronin looks amazing. Like, I really want to get into Ronin, but... Dude, Shirai Ryu, is, he has like a super cool face mask. And he has man. a lot of options as well. Yes, he does. Right there, that EX teleport does pop up for a full combo. 22%. And it does an overhead in the air, correct? Uh, yes, it when actually the it hits version. twice. Yeah. And so the, the first one... Uh, is overhead and then if you do it in the air and then the second one is low, I believe. So he's really trying to utilize the range that Takeda gets from those normals. Oh, Very nice. Use the armor. armor. Oh, it, nice that, throw to the corner. I love the positioning. Yeah, that was really smart stuff to keep him in the corner there. But, oh, but jumps he, right back in. Oh, he cancels the teleport, teleport some mind games. Oh, nice block. No punish, though. It's pretty hard. Well, it's hard to punish things with Takeda, I'm not going to lie. That's actually true. He, he has slow. slower normals. I, I want to say, like, 10 frames is as fast as normal. Aside from jabs. Yeah. Crouching jabs, obviously. Yeah. So good stuff so far, Senior Abram. My new favorite player. <laughs> wow, Dink. I hope you are watching. Uh, That's how much you mean to Brian. Yeah, right. So <laughs> oh, Dink said, oh, we got a Takeda player. Sick. Yeah. New favorite player. I kid, I kid. He's the boy. He's the boy. Man, has laid down his life for you. From the and great white north. gave up on him like that just because yeah. this gentleman wears a mask. That's a that's a tight mask, though. Okay. Let's, Ooh, be, let's be real. Cupcake switching to Aaron Black. I actually, I apologize. I believe Aaron Black was the character he played when we saw him. Was it? I believe so. Hmm. I was thinking Sub Zero yeah, too, so I we're on the same was, page right you now. You know why? It was because he played Scorpion as well. Okay. So it was it was one of the ninjas. The ninjas. The two. So I think Aaron Black is actually a really good choice here. I think it's gonna give Takeda a lot more problems. Oh, beautiful holding for the low mix up. Really, really impressive that's stuff here. So tricky stuff. Yeah, that stuff is so tricky right there. It's also not the easiest to do. It's pretty challenging actually. Yeah. A lot of teleport cancels as well to get advantage. Really impressed here, but now Cupcake has him in the corner, misses the combo. Breaks to keep him in the corner. Smart stuff. I like that. And also that would have led into a full combo, so that was a really smart breaker. Oh, Love but this throwing him back combo. in the corner now. Smart Beautiful. Oh, and the goes for the overhead. That's what I love about Takeda. He has, what, like, three-quarter screen. Uh, <laughs> Mix-ups? Yeah, over overhead low. 
overhead, overhead low, or he can do overhead low, or he can do triple overhead. So, crazy stuff. Trying to convert. Here we go. Lots of little oh, damage. That is very Finally punishable. Blocks. Yeah, he figured he'd be pressing buttons there. Oh, armor wow. It. What a button to use the anti air. Oh, nice. Catches him with the last one, pops him up. Oh, no. The uppercut, though, takes him out of the corner. That's exactly where Cupcake wanted Abram. Correct, yeah. That was uh, definitely not the best finisher he could use for that combo. Oh, oh eats that neutral jump punch again. And here we go, throwing him into the corner now. Back smart stuff. Mm. Oh, I love his combos. They're so swaggy. I'm actually really impressed. I've already seen Cupcake play, so I knew he was a great player, but I'm really impressed with Senior Abram. And again, another neutral jump punch. Here we go. Oh, man. Oh, could have punished that with a neutral, but instead, he's still this combo. Yeah, still pick up the combo there. Great blocks. Wow. Oh, he didn't follow it up with the overhead. He was trying to get a little bit of mix up, maybe bait something out. Smart stuff. This is going to be it. Wow. Senior Abram. Doing work. So this is how you play Takeda. I've actually not seen a very good Takeda. I haven't run into one online. I haven't really seen too many people playing him in any of the other tournaments going on. I've, you played my Takeda, so what are you trying to say? That was um, like day two, though. Let's be honest. Anyways, I've seen a lot of... <laughs> <laughs> Moving forward. <laughs> no, but honestly, I haven't really seen a lot of Takeda, and, I, and I'm really impressed. This character looks very yeah. tricky to block. Sabin uh, uses Takeda. Sabin uses everyone, though. Let's be honest. Does he? He uses, like, two characters. He uses, like, two characters. He uses everybody. All right. <laughs> Shout-outs to our duo. Oh, I'm going to see him this weekend, actually. I'm excited for that. Yeah, man. Combo Breaker. Yeah, make sure you guys are checking out Combo Breaker. That that pot that is going towards that tournament for MKX is because of you guys in the Blue Steel skin. So please check out that tournament as well. It's going to be hype. All right. This is a match point, right? This is for yeah. Senior Abram. Abram here. So Cupcake switching to Scorpion. It's a character we've seen him with before. Good break there. That would have Oh, oh that my goodness, jump so smart with the neutral jump. He's really placing it well, too, because he's baiting all of... Oh, he's trying to bait all of the attacks, all the counter pokes, and he's making him pay, but finally Cupcake has something going for him. And oh, again, man. wow. What an effective tool. That has to be frustrating for Cupcake, though. Like, oh. He, neutral has, jump punch he has not been able to find an answer to that. Oh, man, I think... I wonder if he could have got another... Uh, he just did one hit on the whips if he would have been able to finish him off. Very maybe, possible. Yeah, maybe he knows something. Either way, it worked out for him. Yeah. Round two. Fight. Oh, getting zoned out here a little bit. Teleports in the air. Again, there have been, I think, more neutral jump punch landed in this game than almost the entirety of all three weeks I know, of the I, well, Pro League. And we did see about Dink? 200 neutral yeah. jump punch from Dink uh, last week. But, so he's like, that's ironic that it's the tool that he's using when he just, I mean, advanced past Deke in the bracket. Yeah. So. Maybe that's how he be. He's taking the reins, essentially. Or the responsibility of the neutral jump. Punch. Right. <laughs> and again, these mix-ups. So, oh, oh man, my goodness. Sick. The low into the overhead again. Cupcake does have x-ray, though. Oh, finally, he's blocking those uh, neutral jump punch. Doesn't get a punish, though. And now, Cupcake is just oh. forced to block. He's respecting pretty much every option. Nice blocks, but he's really not getting anything out of it. Oh, no. And again, again. ending with the triple overhead. Wow. This makes me so happy. So. Takeda moves into top four. Takeda, man. man. Yes. Wow, what a <laughs> crazy I'm like, character. I'm sincerely like, super excited. I'm trying not to smile so much. I mean, the stage is purple. Oh, Takeda just won night. a match. Yeah, it is my night. <laughs> Dink unfortunately got DQ'd, which yeah. was good for you. You seem really happy about that. Well, I mean, if I had to trade Dink for Takeda, I mean, it, it's kind of best, you know. Wow. Not that I would ever want to, but wow. if it happened, if that had to happen, I would want a Takeda player to take his place. I'm just, that's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. Oh my goodness. Anyway, really four. solid stuff from Abrin. Um, unfortunately, Cupcake just couldn't get any offense started. Anytime he tried to counter poke off of Takeda's strings, he immediately ate a neutral jump punch. Yeah, into a full combo where Takeda was able to uh, once again do the crazy overhead low mix ups. Yeah. And he was really making them work with those uh, the Kunai charges. Those are so tricky when you can immediately follow them up with either one, two, or three overheads, like six yeah. in a row. 
from half half screen. It's and crazy. he was even doing teleport cancels, which was, was really cool to see because okay. I have not again I haven't really seen high level Takeda. True. So true. it was really neat to see him utilize literally every tool that he had in that specific variation. Yeah, I actually think the only thing he didn't do is like you can jump in the air and do the uh, the like air whip. Oh yeah, he yeah. tried that once or twice, but yeah. it whiffs. So he's like, you know what? I don't need <laughs> it's it. It's not working. That's Why not? smart stuff. Yeah. But I'm just saying, like, that's literally the only thing we didn't see him use. Yes. So great stuff. All right, guys. So remember to follow us on Twitter at ESL Mortal Kombat as well as at Netherrealm and on Facebook, because when we come back, we have the top four for the ESL MKX Pro League presented by Xbox.